Hey everybody, welcome to this week's Wednesday's Top 5. This week I'm going to be doing the Top 5 Core Elite Powerbacks in Madden. I just wanted to take a couple minutes to say I'm very saddened by everything that happened Sunday in Jacksonville. I'm going to send my thoughts out to all the family members and the people that were involved there. I know it's been awesome to watch the community come together but it's sad everybody had to in such a manner I'll link to the GoFundMe page that has been started um, I know anybody that has a presence even my little bitty one here on YouTube will be uh, jumping in and trying to help everybody out as much as possible uh, it's been a tough week for everybody haven't even really feel felt like playing Madden Harley at all this week I wasn't gonna do this video at all but I decided I'd go ahead and put something together not really feeling it but we need to keep moving on and I'm gonna do my little part without further ado we'll jump in thanks everybody for watching and please hit the like and sub button and take care when you uh, look at your family tonight, give them a big hug. And remember, any one of us could be gone at any minute. I uh, almost died in July myself. I got blood clots in my lungs. I'm still trying to recover. This really hits me home, close to home because I know what it feels like to have your life flash before your eyes. Out of your control just from my perspective it's just really sad that somebody would choose to do that to other people and then kill themselves anyway take care let's move on here's my video thank you number five is Derrick Henry he's a very good power back with 83 trucking kinda of slow got decent carry he's been a pretty decent card the last couple years I imagine he'll at some point get an upgrade of course but for the power backs there's not a ton of them to start the game for the core elites so Derrick Henry would definitely be my number five um, might try him out a little bit more I like some other guys better but he's a decent one number four on the list this week for power backs core elite is LeGarrette Blunt with the Lions this year but he's been a power back for many years now in Madden last year's Team Heroes card or the Heroes first hero set I guess the Blunt card was a beast for trucking but he has 88 trucking as a core elite 81 of course he's slow and not one you're going to use a ton, but he's a very good power back. Usually pretty glitchy. But he comes in at my number four this week. Number three, Marshawn Lynch. He's already got an upgrade card this year, but his core elite is, I think it's better than Blunt because he's got better speed at 82 speed. His trucking's just two less. He's always a good, powerful running back in Madden. We'll uh, have to see, try about his uh, upgrade card. I believe it's a, can't remember if it's a flashback. I believe it's a flashback card. I'm, don't quote me on that for sure. I'm not 100% sure, but everybody loves to run with Marshawn Lynch and truck the crap out of people. So he's on number three on my list this year, like I said. And we'll go on to number two. Number two power back core elite this week is Jordan Howard. I know a lot of people probably wouldn't consider him a power back, but when you look at his core elite 84 overall, he's got 83 trucking, 84 speed, 88 carry. Very good power back. Decent trucking. Got enough speed to get her out on the outside early this year. He's our. Uh, of course have already had an upgrade card also 
His upgrade card is a beast and he's a power up. So this is a really good power back to start with and then build up throughout the year. Um, we'll move on to number one, but to me, Jordan Howard, core elite is definitely a power running back. And to nobody's surprise, I'm sure, number one power back core elite card is Leonard Fournette. What can I say? This guy's an absolute 84 overall, 85 speed, 88 carry. He's just 80 break tackle. He's just a really, really good power back with a decent enough speed to actually use him pretty much all the time. I... I like this card a lot. I like to have somebody a little bit faster, but I'd like to have him to sub in and out to pound people with in the short yardage or, you know, break one and smack around those D backs once he breaks through the front line. Anyway, I appreciate you guys watching my video this week. Like I'd said earlier, it's been a sad week for everybody. So we really wasn't into that this video that much. I haven't really played Madden much this week at all. Uh, I love everybody. I hope everybody keeps their head up and keeps plowing forward like I'm sure everybody involved would want us to do. Just keep everybody in your thoughts and prayers and let's try to make the world a little bit kinder place from our part anyway. Take care everybody. Thank you.